Hello everyone, my name is H Timbers and welcome back to Final Phrase VR Help Wanted. Alright, so the new levels are finally out now. So let's try and do that as well as night three again. Night three on danger. Keep out is gonna be hard as hell. But we gotta at least try. Okay, press the button. Alright, let's do this. What kind of new levels do we have? I wonder. What do we got? Coin maze? No Easter eggs here. I'm honestly obsessed with Easter eggs. I don't know why, but it looks like there's an animatronic over there or something. Oh. Anything for... No. It's only for normal mode. So we got Coin Maze and Dread Bear. Let's do Coin Maze first. Let's see what that's all about. And there's also a secret ending on here as well. Yeah, there's also a secret ending in this mini game. Okay, but first let's check the controls. Left controller, all right, left. Move forward, move button, move backward, X button, sideways, square button or triangle button. To turn right controller, press square button or To hide behind panels, press an old T button. Find a key and escape. Okay, this is gonna be hard. Hard as hell to do. But whatever. God. I'm getting the hang of this. Wait, what? Hold on, let me look out. With that. And I'm dead. Okay, now that's gonna be hard to do. But I cannot give up. thing hey you ain't so tough yeah
Too late. Man, this coin maze thing is hard. <laughs> Alright. Let's return the menu. Red Bear. I don't see what that's all about. Oh, see, this is something simple. Welcome back to Research and Development. Today, we are using science to pervert the mysteries of life and reanimate the inanimate. To begin, it is customary for the creator to give a melodramatic speech. Go on, I'll wait. Uh, All done? Yes. Good job. Now, let's wake our little experiment with a controlled shock. Turn the crank to lower the platform, then throw the switch. It's alive, but lacking the necessary control module, namely the brain. So let's calibrate one. Use the laboratory tools to adjust the brain's vital characteristics. Use the blueprints as a guide for matching the correct colors, size, and neurofeedback loop. When you are satisfied, carefully place the brain in the creature's animatronic head cavity.
What? But I invented you. I am your creator. You do not attack your creator. Bad. Yeah, bring your hand over here. It's like throw this at you. How dare you attack your creator? I feel like I'm an embryo or something. <laughs> See this piece of machinery? I invented it! Today, we are using science to pervert the mysteries of life and reanimate the inanimate. To begin, it is customary for the creator to give a melodramatic speech. Go on, I'll wait. Uh... Well done. Good job. Now, let's wake our little experiment with a controlled shock. Turn the crank to lower the platform, then throw the switch. It's alive, but lacking the necessary control module, namely the brain. So, let's calibrate one. Use the laboratory tools to adjust the brain's vital characteristics. Use the blueprints as a guide for matching the correct colors, size, and neurofeedback loop. When you are satisfied, carefully place the brain in the creature's animatronic head cavity. See this piece of machinery? I invented it! Are you gonna kill me? Yes, you did. I don't understand the point of it. I got the color methods right. Fuck you. Fuck you, Dread Bear. Frankenstein. Fuck you, Frankenstein. Welcome back to Research and Development. Today, we are using science to pervert the mysteries of life and reanimate the inanimate. To begin, it is customary for the creator to give a melodramatic speech. Go on, I'll wait. Uh... All done? Good job. Now, let's wake our little experiment with a controlled shot. Turn the crank to lower the platform, then throw the switch. <laughs> See this piece of machinery? I invented it. I invented it. <laughs> it's alive, but lacking the necessary control module, namely the brain. So, let's calibrate one. Use the laboratory tools to adjust the brain's vital characteristics. Use the blueprints as a guide for matching the correct colors, size, and neurofeedback loop. When you are satisfied, carefully place the brain in the creature's animatronic head cavity. I am Embryo, your creator.
<laughs> I'm sorry. That's my fault. I'm sorry, Jay Bear. That was completely my fault. <laughs> Hold on, let me slow it again. and development. Today, we are using science to pervert the mysteries of life this and reanimate the animals. To begin, it is customary for the creator to give a melodramatic speech. Go on, I'll wait. All done? Good job. Now, let's wake up. It's alive, but lacking the necessary control module. Namely, the brain. So, let's calibrate one. Use the laboratory tools to adjust uh, the brain's uh, characteristics. Use the blueprints as a guide for matching the correct color, green. size, and neurofeedback loop. Blue. When you are satisfied, carefully place the brain in the creature's animatronic head cavity. Orange. I'm dead, ain't I? Yep. I don't know what number I'm supposed to put. <laughs> oh. <laughs> You know what, let's just try night three now. I can't, I just wanna do night three. This is too intense for me. And if we do fail night three, then I'll probably end this gameplay video off with the, the pirate ride. I love that thing. And I'm gonna try to get that at least a high score too. You killed your creator. This isn't the end. I invented endings. Why don't people take me seriously? Where is Dreadbear at? Oh, 
Oh god. I'm not gonna make it out. I am not gonna make it. So I might as well enjoy my final moments while they last. Just remain calm. There he is. Oh, dang. Oh, dang. Yeah. Fuck you, Dreadbear. What the? What the hell? Sound of glass breaking. How are those things? Yeah. Yeah. Now, get my prize. Fucking ear bounty. Ooh, that tasty. <laughs> Keep in mind that this DLC pack is nothing more than the a color of sky is different. On. Which has absolutely Again. no hidden intent or purpose. So, have fun. Hmm. Like, let's try out corn maze one more time. Wait, wait, no, 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 no. It wasn't corn maze. It wasn't corn maze. No, 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 no. Yes, exit. Yes, exit level. Want to go back to Dreadbear. 
again. Yeah, Dread Bear. All right, and Brio is back in business. You know, from from Crash Bandicoot, the character. Welcome back to Research and Development. Today, we are using science to pervert the mysteries of life and reanimate the inanimate. To begin, it is customary for the creator to give a melodramatic speech. Go on, I'll wait. All done? Good job. Now, let's wake our little experiment with a controlled shot. It's alive, but lacking the necessary control module, namely the brain. So, let's calibrate one. Use the laboratory tools to adjust the brain's vital characteristics. Use the blueprints as a guide for matching the correct colors, size, and neurofeedback loop. When you are satisfied, carefully place the brain in the creature's animatronic head cavity. Yes, I invented it. What? What the hell? How can you show the right number? Hold on. Let me fully listen to what he says. Let me fully listen. I think I forgot to put the subtitles fully on. Because I literally have to go through the thing twice. Yep, I forgot to. I forgot Today, to do it. We are using science to pervert the mysteries of life and reanimate the inanimate. To begin, it is customary for the creator to give a melodramatic speech. Go on, I'll wait. All done? It's alive, but lacking the necessary control module, namely the brain. So let's calibrate one. Use the laboratory tools to adjust the brain's vital characteristics. Use the blueprints as a guide for matching the correct colors, size, and neurofeedback loop. When you are satisfied, carefully place the brain in the creature's animatronic head cavity. I forgot what he said again. Restart. Damn, I wish they had the subtitles on. Welcome back to Research and Development. Today, we are using science to pervert the mysteries of life and reanimate the inanimate. To begin, it is customary for the creator to give a melodramatic speech. Go on, I'll wait. All done? It's alive, but lacking the necessary control module, namely the brain. So, let's calibrate one. Use the laboratory tools to adjust the brain's vital characteristics. Use the blueprints as a guide for matching the correct colors, size, and neurofeedback loop. When you are satisfied, carefully place the brain Where the in the hell are the blueprints at? Cavity.
He was looking pretty young. And... Well, I give up. I just give up. My own creation, creation is trying to kill me. Yes, I'm talking about you. I invented you. So, to end this gameplay video off, we're going to do uh, the pirate ride thing again. Because I love that thing. Keep in mind that this DLC yeah, 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 shut up. I have not seen, like, any good Easter eggs other than the sky turning red at times. Yeah, get a high score. Let's do it. Okay. For your safety, keep your hands inside the ride at all times. For your <laughs> Okay. Okay, this is very disturbing. But whatever. Ahoy! <laughs> Ah, oh, crap. Whatever. <laughs> Whoa. What? Th 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 that was it? No, it can't be it. Oh no, it's not it yet. No, it's not over yet. Whoa. <laughs> Fox is trying to get Chica to <laughs> Chica Mermaid. Yay. So now what? Now let's see how you did. Yeah. yeah. That was actually pretty awesome. <laughs> Still gotta try and beat my high score though. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Right. Ooh, a cupcake candy, a little cupcake candy bucket. Cool. Yo, they should actually make these. They should actually make a uh, ha Halloween buckets in the shape of the, the cupcake 
based on cupcake. <laughs> that would be amazing. Anyways, continue. And that's the same bucket with the button inside that we press to go to Curse of Dread Bear. This bucket. Same one. Hmm. But anyways, y'all. Let's go back. Let's see if there's anyone new in the gallery. I honestly doubt it, though. Because the only new animatronics... Because the only animatronics we saw on those two levels were... Grim Foxy and Dread Bear. From Corn Maze and Dread Bear. Whew. Let's see. And I was right. So, return to the main menu. Although I couldn't beat Corn Maze or Dread Bear, we all have to admit on one thing. At least I did good. Beating night three, y'all. At least I beat night three. But I wonder why Jacko bon Bonnie and Jacko Chica didn't appear though. During like the half, during like the last three hours, from four to six. I wonder why they didn't appear while it was only Grim Foxy and Dread Bear. Meh, excuse me. But yeah, again, Dread Bear is really hard anyway, so. It was all good and cool. I didn't really care about Jacko Bonnie and Jacko Chica appearing. Because honestly, it will make it much more harder and complicated. <sighs> Look at warning. Alright. Press the D button. <sighs> yeah. Alright y'all, so I'm done with this gameplay, and if y'all enjoyed, please like and subscribe, it really helps out a lot, and from the game videos every day, but anyways guys, I love you guys, I'm gonna see y'all tomorrow for some more of Luigi's Mansion 3, and next week, I'll also play some more Final Fantasy VR Help Wanted, try and complete some of the levels, mostly Corn Maze and Dreadbear, especially Corn Maze, because there's like a secret ending there. Alright, but anyways guys, I love you guys, thank y'all for watching, and as always, I will see you guys in the next video, bye bye!